Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Jada Simone and you're watching Jada's channel. So as you guys can see by the title of today's video, I will be doing a way, way, way long overdue candle unboxing for Bath & Body Works. Now y'all, let me give y'all a rundown on these candles. I think it's like, it's probably like 20 candles in here. Not even, it's probably like 12 candles in here. But um, honestly, truly, I ordered these candles back in November, like November 8th during Candle Day. Or whenever Candle Day was back in November. But y'all, I still haven't opened this package. Like... <laughs> I was pressed to get my candles and what irritated me about them was that because I got so many candles they sent two different packages so originally I got one box from them and it was just one candle it was one small little box like this with one candle in it and I was like what the heck where's the rest of my candles so the rest of my candles took like two more weeks to get to me and I was so pressed to get them that I didn't even open them like why was I so pressed not to even open them because at this point it's March 9th at 9 55 at night and i still have yet to open these candles so we will be opening the candles together so the first candle is actually a candle that i already opened it was the first candle that got delivered to me and it is my favorite scent by bath and body works and it is cactus blossom y'all it, it don't have a top on it because I don't know what the top is. <laughs> I like to like let my candles sit out and like smell them sometimes before I burn them because these candles are super potent. So you could just have the candle sitting on your desk like this and it'll smell up the whole room. So yeah, Cactus Blossom. I really love this design. I feel like this design is just very simplistic, very chic. You can put this design literally anywhere. You can put it in your bedroom, um, you can put it in the bathroom, or even put it in like the living room, kitchen. Like this design is very, very, very minimalistic and simple, but it's a design. So it's not like too minimal where it's like, you know, super plain, but like, you know, it makes a small little statement. So I'm just gonna read what Cactus Blossom is from the bottom. And it is cactus, flower petals, sun-kissed coconut, vanilla, sparkling, fresh lemon, and essential oils. And y'all, if you have not smelled the scent, y'all need to smell this scent. Like, you will fall in love. The rest of my candles are in this big old box, y'all. Like, now I gotta find some scissors to open this big old box. So, I opened the box, and this is just how the box looks inside. It comes with, um all the stuff that I ordered the total and all that and honestly y'all I actually did order like 20 candles but you know it's candle day so a lot of them were sold out so they ended up refunding me for a lot of candles so in total only got one two three four five six seven eight nine nine candles which is kind of a bummer because I kind of was expecting like 12 or maybe I'm wrong maybe this is wrong we gonna see so yeah the candles just come like this and they're in like the little crate so that they don't crack and I hope none of my candles crack honestly so I'm about to just randomly pull out candles and show y'all all right so the first candle I pulled out is mahogany teak wood high intensity and I actually never smelled mahogany teak wood or the high intensity but a lot of people talk about it so I'm about to smell it for the first time Mmm, this it smells like a man, but like it smells like men's cologne, like a sexy man. Like <laughs> this smells really, really good. I would put this in like a living room or something. So it just says on the back, an intense version of our classic home fragrance with notes of rich mahogany, black teak wood, dark oak, and frosted lavender with essential oils. So this, y'all, this smells so freaking good. Like. Oh. I'm happy I got this. I kind of was scared because I never smelled it before. And you know, when stuff is overhyped, you just be like, mm, I tend not to believe the hype, but believe the hype on this one. That one, believe the hype. This next candle is coconut sandalwood, and it is also another candle that I have never smelled before, but I love coconut, and I felt like sandalwood would be cool, so let's just smell it. Mm, it don't really smell like nothing to me. I guess a little, a little like teeny bit sandalwoody, but I don't smell any coconut. Maybe I'll smell it once I burn it. On the back, it just says coconut palm, luxurious sandalwood, warm musk, jasmine with essential oils. Um, I don't smell none of these. Like it literally smells like Play-Doh. Like it just, it don't smell like nothing. 
but hopefully once I burn it it smells like something because I'm a little disappointed I'm not even gonna lie because I really love coconut as a scent all right so by the looks of all the candles that I'm pulling out it seems like I only ordered candles that I never tried before which is kind of weird <laughs> but because like I've never tried this one so this is black teak wood um so let's smell it mmm okay this smells really good but I feel like it smells the same let's Okay, they smell similar, but they don't smell the exact same. So this black teak wood smells very similar to the um, mahogany woods. Um, I like it. I, I honestly do really like it. I feel like it'll smell really, really good. I just hope that when I burn these, they're not too intense to where they give me a headache. But on the back, it just says rich mahogany, black teak wood, dark oak, frosted lavender. Um, that sounds like the same notes. Y'all, this is literally the same notes. This is literally the same candle. No wonder why they smelled ex like just alike. Um, that's a little weird. These are the exact same notes. Like, am I bugging? It says rich mahogany, mm hmm, black teak wood, dark oak, frosted left. Y'all, these are the same candle. I don't know why my brain tricked me and make, like they're the same candle what the heck so if they ever add a stock of this one because this one is like everybody's fave get the black teak wood because they're the same candle and I kind of feel ripped off <laughs> like I kind of really do feel ripped off but I really like the way that one smells so I guess I have a double of it but they're the same freaking candle like <sighs> so the next one is the regular mahogany teak wood and I honestly didn't remember ordering this so yeah, it smells just like the other ones. <laughs> so I have three of the same freaking candle. On the back, again, it says rich mahogany, black teak wood, dark oak, frosted lavender, and essential oils. I have three of the same freaking candle, y'all. Like maybe I should have read on the website the notes before I clicked order. But I honestly, I don't know. I hope I hope when they burn, they smell really good. And I hope I really like them. Because when I burn my candles, I burn them. Like, I be having a candle burning all day, every day. So, now that I have three of the same candle, I hope I really like it. And, because, <laughs> y'all, I will be so mad if I have to gift candles because I don't like them. Okay, so the next one is actually a very familiar face. And it is Eucalyptus Mint. And, y'all, y'all know I love Eucalyptus. <laughs> Eucalyptus is just so calming. Like, it just reminds you of a spa, a nail salon. Well, not a nail salon. Y'all know nail salons smell like acetone. But, like, you know, a spa, getting your feet done. Those vibes. So, mm, it smells really, really good. The only thing that I just noticed is that it seems like my candle was kind of, like, peeled. I don't know if y'all can see those peelings in the wax, but it's not too crazy. When I light it, it's all going to melt together. But... Yeah, this smells, mm, I feel like I'm going to light this tonight while I take my bath. Like, light it in the bathroom with me because this smells so freaking good. So, the notes on the back are fresh eucalyptus, sweet spearmint, lemon peel, clary sage, and essential oils. Y'all, if you haven't, like, if you're not on the eucalyptus train, you need to get on it because eucalyptus is, she's that girl. She's, she ain't come to play. All right, y'all. So the next one is actually a familiar face. We do like her. We know her. <laughs> We've experienced her before. And it is just um, a part of the aromatherapy line. And it is in the scent Love, which is rose and vanilla. And I actually really do love this scent. I get the body wash of it all the time in the body scrub. This scent is just, oh y'all this scent i put the body wash in my bubble bath so like it just made me think of bubble bath and i might just light this in my bath instead of you could slip this mint we gonna see but this is just like it just smells like love like it smells like like puppy dog stage like when you in the puppy dog stage with jimmy and you just like so happy and in love and you see her eyes this is what that smell like <laughs> 
so the back notes just say rose oil and it says feelings of connection and self-confidence and then um vanilla extract which is which encourages relaxation so yeah just rose and vanilla in this one and it just smells amazing okay the next one is another cactus blossom and i didn't even realize that i ordered two cactus blossoms i showed y'all in the beginning the first one that came first before all the other candles weeks before other, all the other candles but this is another cactus blossom and it's just in a different packaging but yeah i'm not gonna read the notes for cactus blossom again i'm just gonna show you guys this packaging it's super cute i will put this in like my bathroom um because my bathroom is pink so i feel like you know it'll complement the decor but i love cactus blossom this is my all-time favorite scent and i hope they never um what is it i hope they never discontinue it because i feel like at one point they did and they brought it back so if they do it again i'm a I'm gonna have to throw hands of Bath and Body Works. All right, um, this next one, I'm kind of regretting now that I'm looking at it. And these candles are super dusty. So if you guys see dust flying around, it's because they're really dusty. They must have been in the warehouse forever. But um, <laughs> this one is making me regret waiting so long to open my freaking candles because this is actually a winter Christmassy scent. It's Frosted Cranberry and it's just like decorated really nice like Christmas the top is really nice like Christmas and well honestly it smells good I feel like you can still burn it but I feel like I might save this candle and a lot of my candles like I have candles that like I got over the summer that I still have yet to burn so this candle probably really will get saved until Christmas and I really have to make a mental note not to go back to Beth uh, not Bath and Body Works. Oh yeah, yeah, Bath and Body Works. I get Bath and Body Works and Bed Bath and Beyond confused. So there's that. But I have to make a mental note not to go back and buy more candles because y'all, I literally buy candles and y'all see they just sit. I gotta get together. But that's because I be buying so many. But this will definitely get saved for Christmas. And the notes on this are iced cranberries, blonde woods, red apple, tonka bean, and essential oils. And y'all this just smells really good i have the car freshener version of this as well but i haven't opened it yet for my car a good christmas scent is this one it's not too like like cheesy christmas like cookies or like um what is it like that's not spearmint like the big red gum flavor like that i don't know how to describe that flavor but i don't like it um but it's not like the typical christmas flavor it just it's like glam clip christmas in a sense okay y'all and last but not least well last yeah last but not least <laughs> is another christmas candle that will be getting saved for christmas and i didn't even peep that they're red and green oh this is so cute so when i decorate for christmas next well this year coming up my candles will be out on display in my living room this is vanilla bean noel and i really like vanilla bean noel I actually do have the car freshener version of this in my car right now and one thing I can say about their car fresheners is that they last really long like I have two in my car I have one in my visor and one in my uh, vent and when I tell y'all I've had those in my car for like three maybe four months and they're still going strong it doesn't even look like the liquid has evaporated from them so definitely invest in those but also invest in your candles it smells really really good and the notes on the bottom are just vanilla bean marshmallow fluff and vanilla cake very vanilla -y. but i feel like it's not very obnoxious like i've had i still have a very obnoxious um what is it what's the other candle place yankee candle i have a very obnoxious yankee candle vanilla candle when i tell y'all i have a big one my mom bought me a big one of it and when i tell y'all i cannot get through the scent like you don't even have to burn it like i said just put it out on your vanity or on your dresser or something and you can smell it and it gives me a headache i don't like that candle but this one is not like that candle she is not like her she seems very subtle like a very subtle sweet vanilla scent and that's what i like so got her okay y'all so that is all for today's video i hope you guys like this video don't forget to give me a like a comment and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and please click that bell so you guys are notified every time i upload a new video i hope you guys um participated in candle day like y'all see i clearly have but i hope y'all been opened y'all candles and been started burning y'all candles but now it gives me an excuse to start burning my candles i can have a candle in every room now because <laughs> i got so many but 
yeah thank you guys so so much for watching i love you guys and i'll see y'all in the next one bye guys